New tonight at 6. Just a few years ago, it would have been impossible, but with some new technology now, people who are paralyzed are able to get up and walk. This is happening right now at the James A. Haley VA Hospital here in Tampa. Incredible. Fox 13's Lloyd Sowers shows us how this is working and how it's changing lives. Doctors told Army veteran Stephen Bush that he'd never walk again after a bike accident in 1995, but he never gave up. Your injury shouldn't stop you from living. You just have to do things differently. He never dreamed how different it could be. It's amazing new technology, a suit that allows people who are paralyzed to get up and walk. He controls it from his wrist. And then it starts to walk. And then I just have to continue to shift left and right as I walk and uh, maintain position. Called the rewalk, Steve guides it with his balance and body weight, activating small electric motors to propel his legs. A helper goes along. Tampa is one of a handful of VA hospitals in the country testing the technology. It's still new. But hopefully five, ten years from now, this is normal routine that patients come in, they get their exoskeleton uh, on and, uh, and go home with it. The Rewalk exoskeleton suit is expensive, over $70,000. But like other technology, the price could come down. And if tests go well, more paralyzed veterans could stand up. Now, being up in the the device, you know, we can talk eye to eye. For a man who was told he'd never walk again, with technology, Steve is taking some big steps. Lloyd Sowers, Fox 13 News. Rewalk is the first such system cleared by the FDA. If testing goes well, and they're hoping it will, more paralyzed veterans will get to take them home.